In this video we show how you can programmatically add uh, bubble help to a uh, field in a list control. So you can see that we have a simple list control over here and when we hold our mouse over um, any one of the um, uh, fields in the list we get a pop-up uh, bubble help that has been customized for the current row. So you can see here this says customer lives in New York and this says customer lives in Los Angeles etc. So let's take a look at how we did this. So we'll go back to um, the builder and uh, uh, in the list builder we can see that this list is based on uh, static data and the static data itself has additional columns that are not displayed in the list. We have a city column and a state column. The list itself is only displaying the first name and last name. So the way in which the bubble help was added is uh, through the uh, through an event. So we'll go to our list events and we can see here we have the on item draw event which fires as each row is drawn. So the first thing that we want to do is get a pointer to the actual element uh, for the last name column. So you can see that we have the special placeholder here called list element colon last name and that was inserted by uh, using this uh, insert element placeholder uh, hyperlink. So this is now giving us a pointer to the element for last name and then we're using the built-in function called set attribute so dollar sign set attribute passing in the element that we'd like to set the attribute on and we're setting the the title attribute which is the element for bubble help and then here's the uh, value of the title that we're dynamically setting so you can see that we're referencing the uh, city field in the current row which we got by just clicking the insert field button over there which gives us data for all of the fields in the current row so we're just writing some JavaScript that generates the expression that, uh, or the text that we'd like to set the bubble help to so customer lives in and then data.city then a comma and then data.state so this is how we dynamically set the bubble help uh, which is the title attribute for the element so let's go back now and then run it again go to working preview put our mouse over Smith and we can see there's our dynamic bubble help so the ability to generate dynamic bubble help using the on item draw uh, event uh, is a powerful feature of the list control thanks very much for watching